Market Profiles of Millennials. Hello mga kaangat! Today, we will give you insights kung sino-sino nga ba ang bumubuo ng millennial generation dito sa Pilipinas. The millennials, aka Generation Y, are described as technology savvy, adaptable to change, able to multitask, highly educated, opinionated, demanding, and have less direction. Also, dubbed as the digital natives who are growing up amid social networks and rapidly evolving technology. Sino-sino nga ba ang bumubuo ng generation na ito? Ano-ano ang mga characteristics or attitude ang meron sila? Tara, mas kilalanin pa natin sila. Let's have a sneak peek of this generation facts. In the Philippines, Filipino millennials, also known as Filenials, make up one-third of the country's total population. Ibig sabihin, 3 out of 10 na tao na kilala mo ay nasa age group na ito. In the 2010 census, there are an estimated 25 million Filipino millennials, 12,600,000 are female, and 12,900,000 are male. In educational attainment, according to a study, among Filipino millennials, women outpacing men in college completion. In 2018, 43% are women and 36% are men who graduated with a bachelor's degree. In terms of career, more than 50% of the working age population are millennials and 45% of them are employed. Karamihan sa mga millennials age 16 to 18 ay gusto magtrabaho abroad dahil sa experience at magandang opportunity. Millennials want everything fast, and instant gratification is what drives them. They tend to do things quickly with their gadgets and access to the web. Career growth is what they consider in a job. Ability to progress and take on leadership roles in the future is the key driver for the millennials to grab the opportunity. Pagdating naman sa lifestyle, watching television, texting, listening to music, playing sports, meeting up with friends, surfing or going online, and reading are most common activities of the Filipino millennials age 15 to 24. Dahil sa gusto rin nila ng mga bilisan at mga on-the-go thing, ang mga kadalasang kinakain nila ay mga ready-to-eat foods like instant noodles, chips, and street foods. Technology and Social Media Most of the Filipino youth today own a cell phone and use the internet. Once dubbed as the social media capital of the world, most Filipino youth have a social networking account, with Facebook as the most common one. The Filipino millennials aged 20 to 29 are the most common users of Facebook. Millennials also describe themselves as fearless, empowered, and entitled. A significant portion of the population now is composed of the Filipino youth. Malaki ang role ng mga millennials sa pagbuo ng bagong kasaysayan ng bansa. Now, they are the decision makers. They are the game changers. Since you've seen po ano-ano nga ba ang mga facts of being a millennial, are you one of them or are you just a millennial by heart? I hope these facts will help you to capture our millennial market. And don't stop in exploring ideas on how we will engage them. Thank you mga kaangat for joining us today. Again, this is Frank of TOPP South. Have a great Cassandra day. the attention of millennials. Ayan! Very interesting. Ready na ba kayo, guys? Ready, Ready na ba kayo, guys? Wow, so magbabas ako. Okay, watch this video! Good morning, Lisandra. From Describing Millennials, let's discuss on how to attract these generations. As you can see, millennials are no longer kids. They are adults under 40. They are growing up and giniisip na nila yung next stage ng life nila. Aware din naman tayo na millennials are driving the economy today since almost one-third sila ng populations natin ngayon. 
The reason why firms and marketing agencies are targeting the so-called before the happy-go-lucky persons or the millennials today. So, paano nga ba natin ma-attract ang generations na ito? Let us give you some tips and ideas on how to capture their attention in buying services. We know that millennials are digital savvy and technology dependent. From time to time, hawak nila yung gadgets nila, the reason why updated sila sa lahat ng bagat. You must be present on where they are. Maximize the market on digital platforms, so make sure meron ka ng account sa lahat ng social media like Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, LinkedIn, and Twitter. Your content must be catchy and good read. Millennials are also enticed through visuals, so use your best photos and high-resolution videos on posting. Aware naman tayo na may kli ang pasensya ng mga millennials today. According sa study, hanggang 8 seconds lang ang average attention span nila na mabibigay. Kaya kung magpo-post ka, make sure na direct, may kli, at andan lahat ng informations. Create a bite-sized content. Sa panahon yun, ang daming poser at fake news. Kaya hindi madali magtiwala ang mga millennials. They are taking in consideration the comments and recommendations. In order to gain their trust, pwede ka mag-post ng testimonials ng mga buyer mo at i-highlight mo yung maganda experience nila during the transaction. Millennials also consider yung dami ng likes at followers ng page, pati na din yung good ratings at review. It builds credibility and it also creates curiosity for the people looking at your page or account. May role din ng organization or company na kinabibilangan mo. You need to convince millennials that you are not selling nonsense things. I-highlight mo yung achievement, organization, and other useful matters na magpo-prove na you're selling a valuable service and make a difference. Millennials are independent and seeking work-life balance. They are also risk takers. Alam nila ang gusto nila at hahanap sila ng pinakamadaling way para makuha ito. Once you grab their attention, take care of that and respond to them immediately. Give an honest and direct answers to all their questions right away. Initiate and present the step-by-step -step process from inquiry to purchase. Millennials are the least engaged entity within workforce. They do want the ability to train and develop, and to have a work environment that reflects their life environment. Despite of that, millennial audience grows more realistic and mature. Instead, play to the sensibilities of educated and plug-in adults. Every generation has distinct behavior and purpose sa ating society. Kailangan natin mag-adjust para makasabay sa kanila. So just keep these tips in mind in order to capture millennials' attention.